I, one of the things that we think is for this nation to be competitive in the future, you're going to have to have a healthy workforce. Right now, we have a lot of people that are not healthy because of dependencies or depression or physical disability. And one of the main reasons, I shouldn't say one of the main reasons, one of the reasons is that there is a tremendous amount of stress. And the number one stressor, or generally for people, is work. And what we found out is how we design systems and how we educate people and send them out. They're not aware of people. They're aware of machines and equipments and equations and things like that. But they're not aware of the soul of people and motivation of people. So how do we integrate that? If we're going to be competitive, we have to have a healthy workforce, and therefore we have to reduce the stress. Companies don't have to choose between productivity and the well-being of their employees. This is what this lab is. This lab, we have students that experiment with running different machines and different uh, processes, and then they measure stress to see what are the factors that are impacting it. And then we learn from here and we go to the companies and we are now at this moment in several different companies implementing. And we can show to some extent that I can reduce the physical exertion on almost every employee that I can enhance the productivity. That means people can work less and produce more. This symposium is for us to be able to bring a community here together so that we can propose this idea to you. That you don't have to choose between people and productivity, you can get both.